Romantic sponges, they say, do it. Oysters down in Oyster Bay, do it. Let's do it. Let's fall in love. Cold Cape Cod clams against their wish, do it. Even lazy jellyfish, do it. Let's do it. Let's fall in love. Electric eels, I might add, do it. Though it shocks them, I know. Why ask if Shad do it? Waiter, bring me Shadro in shallow shoals. English souls do it. Goldfish in the privacy of balls do it. Let's do it. Let's fall in love. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers, James. What a great Cheers, performance. James. Thank you. Thank you. So, what do we know about Cole Porter as a man? Well, I suppose, I mean, I suppose one of the key things about him is that he's a gay man who is married, um, comes to Paris, 1918, because of the war. And Cole Porter's from a wealthy family, but he depends on his grandfather. And that depends on, on behaving in a way that his grandfather would approve of. And grandfather's very much a man's man and has constantly been trying to make Cole into a man and failed. So Cole's in Paris. Dad, uh, grandfather doesn't know what he's up to, really. Paris is a much more liberal city for a gay man. And, you know, he can tell grandfather and his mother what he's doing, but it doesn't mean it reflect what he's actually doing. So what was Cole Porter actually up to in Paris? Well, he had a lovely apartment. He's having great parties. He's meeting young men. He's meeting the, the, the demi-monde, but also the beau monde. He's meeting... Uh, the important people of the day, and he's singing and playing, entertaining, and having a few drinks. And what was going on in the 1920s? Was he particularly successful professionally? Well, he wrote loads of songs at, at Yale, and he continued to write all the way through, really, but it wasn't until 1928 with Let's Do It that they actually had a big hit. So this was a real turning point for him? Completely, yeah. Yeah, and suddenly he gets that validation of actually being taken seriously, and that leads to being taken seriously for Anything Goes and into his Hollywood career, where he was perhaps most successful. The music is playful as well as the words. You can play around with it, you can pull it this way, and that's very elastic. Great piece. You played it beautifully. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. You're a great audience. <laughs> <laughs>